see how to do the branch skills one and two using our studio. So this is creating a branch, making a change on a branch, and then merging that change back into the main. So here I am on our studio. Over here is where I can switch branches, and over here is where I can create branches. So I click there, create it. I'm going to call it development. Uh, I'm not going to sync with remote, so that's saying sync with GitHub. Uh, I'm going to be develop deleting this very soon. So, okay. so now it shows me what branch I'm on. I can kind of jump back and forth. I am now going to make a change on this branch. Okay, there we go. Save that. Now I'll commit it. Maybe I stage it and then commit it. Lots of pop up windows. There we go. Oh, no pop up windows. Okay. So now I have a change uh, on the development branch. I created the development branch and I made a change on it and I committed it. So that was skill number one. Next skill is to merge the changes on the development branch into the main branch. Now, here's where the you run into the fact that the Git R Studio graphical interface is pretty minimal, really. In addition to all those weird pop-up windows, um, it just doesn't have all the commands that you'd be familiar with with a, a more functional graphical user interface. And in this case, um, if you're going to be using Git from our studio, you will um, need to be able to work from the command line if you're working with branches. Because you're not going to be able to merge from the, the GUI. We're going to have to do that from the command line. So first thing, when we're merging, we need to get onto the branch we're going to merge into. So now we're on main. And we want to merge that change from development into the main branch. So we need to open up the shell nicely. It makes it easy to open up the shell. That's great. So jump there and it put us right at our repository. And we want to compare the branches before we merge, perhaps. Again, the, the RStudio GUI doesn't doesn't really have a way to do this, so we're going to have to do this from the command line. So that would be git diff uh, main dot dot. And compare them. What we see here is that the development line, um, development branch has this extra line here. Now we want to merge, so we run the git merge development. So it's important to know where you are before you run this line. Be absolutely certain you know what branch you're on. If you have any questions, you just can run status. Let's see you're on branch main. Of course, you could just do branch here like this, and you will see asterisk that I'm on the main branch, and there's the development branch. Okay, so now I'm happy I am on main, so git merge. There we go, and you can see now here I'm on the main branch. Let's go back to our studio. I'm on the main branch, and that line from the dev branch has shown up. Okay, that's the end of skills one and two.